Hello, Taurus. This is your daily for the 19th through the 20th. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Thank you for coming. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Your inner power, the Divine Father. Divine Father, thank you for co-creating my world with me. That's what we have. <clears throat> what other messages do we have for my Taurus friends here? Trying to gain your balance, trying to be sure of something here. Something else wanted to flip. Um, maybe starting over with someone or starting something new even. Business venture, maybe trying to get your balance in check, period. Um, there's something that you're trying to find harmony around, trying to find peace around. Maybe um, some of you guys are trying to compromise with somebody here on this new start. Hmm. Maybe there's a reunion that you guys are seeking here with maybe a Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius or Capricorn even. This doesn't have to be those signs, but um, it's just the energy that's here. Okay, guys. Hmm. I see you guys being very anxious around something. You're very anxious about it. And I, I think that you're having trouble trying to figure out like how to make this happen. How to make it happen here. But I feel like if you guys really just sit down and, and, and figure out what it is that you want first and foremost, I think it will lead you to it would lead it will lead you to like a way to do this. I think your heart will lead you. Okay. Um, sometimes situations can be tough. And then as I look at the bottom of the deck, there's a glare on that. Sorry. Um, I see the Ace of Cups. So there, there's somebody that you guys, I feel like either you want to reunite with them or they want to reunite with you. They want to work things out so you guys can work together here. Okay. Because temperance is all about balancing out the water and the fire here. Okay, and then we have the water and the fire here. So you guys are, I feel, trying to not only gain balance and harmony within your personal life, personally, um, singularly, but I think that this involves another individual as well, okay? Trying to figure out how you can do this. How can you do this smoothly, okay? So it will go off without a hitch. Let's see why this is happening. Yeah, two of swords. I feel like you guys are trying to guard yourself. Maybe you feel like somebody is going to reject you or not accept whatever it is you have to offer. Or they feel that way about you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I think you guys would prefer it if this, the other individual, um you know, step forward first because maybe you feel like you have invested enough. Maybe you feel like you've done enough and you're just waiting on them to, you know, make this presentation to you, to pitch this to you, whatever it is that they want. Um, because I think you guys are guarded at this point. Let's see what else we have. Yeah. Yeah. I had the feeling that the magician would show up here because, you know, I feel like you guys have the power to make this happen. Somebody here, somebody that's listening, um, they know exactly what they want, okay? And they know exactly how to get it. I think what's really going on here is that... Um, some of you that are watching are feeling like somebody actually needs to come to you. Okay? And you know that what you have put into this, you've done all that you can do and you're just waiting. Okay? And then others of you are feeling like 
you know, you really just don't want to be, um, you don't want to be hurt. You don't want to be rejected, but you feel like, you know, it's up to you to bring this harmony back into this situation. Okay. Gemini energy here. Um, Libra as well. Let's see what the influence is for you guys. Somebody's having a lot of regrets regarding this situation. Um, and somebody wants to make it better. Somebody wants to make this situation right. Okay. Somebody really wants to make this situation right. Whether it's you, my Taurus friends, or um, someone else. But there is somebody that is feeling like, you know, um, we can do this again. We can make this happen. But somebody's leery. Somebody's leery that, you know, that they'll be the one that's rejected. That, you know, this is a missed opportunity even. Okay. Let's see what the advice is for you guys. Mm. I think that the advice is um, for whoever is needing to actually make the gesture. Um, just, just make sure that you're grounded here. Um, make sure that you are going with the right intentions. Um, and I think this person will see you for exactly who you are and what you are actually bringing to them. Okay. Um, just show that you are supportive. If they are hurt, if you feel like you have hurt them before, just be supportive of that person. Okay. It's what I'm getting here for you guys. And of course, um, either way, you know, if this is for a cross watcher, then this would apply for you too. Okay. Now under the bottom of the deck, we have the King of Swords. Speak truthfully. Speak truthfully from your heart, from a grounded place. Okay. So that's what I have for you, my friends. And I will be speaking with you guys soon.